Hey dolls! It is Meta349 or Barbie. I respond to either. <laughs> no, I just got this shirt off of AliExpress. It was literally only a couple dollars, so yeah, I'm I'm, I'm repping it. I got all the pink things today. I got my pink hair, my new pink shirt, my uh, pink fidget spinny thingy, and of course, my pink drink. So I do have a thrift haul for you guys, but before I get into that, I want to let you guys know that I'm going to be doing a meet and greet on July 9th. So this isn't for a little while, but I wanted to kind of give you guys a heads up, let you know in advance so you can kind of schedule it and make the plans. It is going to be in the Tri-Cities area of Washington, specifically at Kennewick. So if you are in my local area, this will give you the opportunity to come and meet me and hang out and a lot of fun stuff. So the thrift store haul that I'm going to be doing for you guys today is actually where I'm going to be doing my meetup. So it's going to be at the Seattle Children's Bargain Boutique. If you are in Kennewick, it is off Kennewick Ave, kind of by Rite Aid and China Cafe, across the street from Denny's and Carl's Jr., kind of in that area. But basically it is a thrift store that carries new and gently used items and 100 billion percent of all of the proceeds go directly to the Seattle Children's Hospital for those families of the those children who can't afford treatment and I think what they do is completely and totally amazing and they wanted to partner with me and team up with me and have a meet and greet so again that will be on July 9th I will go ahead and show you guys the address right here so July 9th this right here is the address it is the Seattle Children's Bargain Boutique. And also, it is a great place for you to go and donate your own. They don't just have clothes, they also have shoes, housewares, bags, belts, all kinds of stuff. So if you have new or gently used items and you are in my area, that is a great place to go and donate because 100% of the proceeds from all of those sales go directly to the Seattle Children's Hospital. So for my meet and greet, I will be donating. I will be donating a lot of stuff. I plan on going through my closet and donating a lot of stuff so if you come to the meet and greet you'll have the option to kind of shop my closet but yet 100% of the proceeds will go to the Seattle Children's Hospital. It, none of it will go to me. I'm not profiting from it at all whatsoever. I guess the best payment I get out of it is the fact that I'm helping a cause or I'm donating for a cause and you guys are too. So yes, it will be July 9th. I know I've said this 500,000 times, but July 9th, noon to probably 3 or 4 p.m. And uh, there will be raffles. I have a couple raffle baskets that I've been putting together that I hope you guys will love. There'll be a couple gift cards for the boutique itself. They will be giving away and raffling some like uh, gift cards for that. Uh, there will be snacks, uh, like I said, prizes, maybe games, music. Um, I'm thinking about getting a photo backdrop of some sort and doing photos with you guys. I have printed off several uh, photos so I can do autographs and just hang out with you guys and we can even shop together if you want. I think it would be really, really fun. And again, this is all for a cause. I love the fact that I'm able to meet you guys and hang out with you guys but we all get to get together for a cause and help children and I think that is so 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 amazing so thank you again so much Seattle Children's Bark and Boutique for teaming up with me specifically Diana thank you so much for reaching out to me she is so so sweet if you guys go to the meetup you will meet her and she is just uh, an angel I love her so much so yes and I will be vlogging everything and I think one of my friends is going to be there taking photos for me and so yes if you want to be in my vlog and come say hi and hang out and have some snacks and maybe win some prizes I plan on getting a couple Ulta gift cards to give away so yeah if you guys want to come and hang out you are more than welcome to July 9th at noon to about 3 or 4 p.m. So without further ado, I went to the Bargain Boutique today and I got some stuff. Okay, so 
I got these little pillowcases. I haven't actually opened them yet, but they're just standard uh, pillowcases. It comes in a two pack and they kind of match the bedding that I already have. It's just kind of cute and pastel and simple and floral and fun. So I decided to get those. Oh, and I also wanted to mention that they are constantly getting new items in from Zoo Lily. If you guys love Zoo Lily, that is definitely a place to go because they have a lot of stuff. They have a whole rack dedicated to just Zoo Lily stuff and like everything on it is like $5.50. At least that's how it was when I went today. So that those prices might vary here and there, but they do have like brand new stuff that they get shipped in from Zoo Lily. So that is really, really cool. Uh, this is brand new, never been worn, still has the tags on it. I think this was one of the Zoo Lily items actually, but it is this little kind of chevron long dress and it's got like a hot pink collar right here and hot pink on the little sleeves with a little ruffle which I thought was really cute and I figured that this would be super adorable cinched at the waist it's kind of a crazy print I don't usually go for crazy ones like this but uh I'm gonna see, try it out and see if I like it Okay, and then, you guys, I had to get this. You know, I had to get this. It is a Gem in the Holograms t-shirt. Ah, it's literally me. Like, it's literally me. So it says, truly outrageous. And it's got Gem on there. And as soon as I saw this, I freaked out. And Diana, she was like, I was going to tell you about that and see if it was something you were interested in. And I'm like, girl, yes, bring me up. <laughs> Okay, and then this shirt right here I got in the like little girls section. Uh, I don't really quite know what this is. It's the brand Betty's Blue. And it says Betty's Princess and Amy of the Sea. I don't know what this is. I don't know if this is from something. But it's really cute and colorful. And I thought that this would be adorable to pair with, you know me, high-waisted skirts and uh, high-waisted shorts and just like tucked in so cute I don't know I love the colors and I love the little bear on here how his face is all like obscured and lopsided I don't know I just think it's really unique and cute and it's fun it's it's me I don't know what it is but it's me <laughs> okay then I got this little crappy top right here it's kind of like an off-white like cream color this will be great with again some high-waisted items very cute and simple then I got this in the little girl section too it is like a tube dress and you can see it's got some like chevron style zigzag uh, kind of I don't know it's like really cool it's not like embroidered or anything on there it's just kind of like the fabric I don't know how to describe that it's like a pattern or whatever and then it just kind of flows out and this nice little tube dress to slip on over a swimsuit during the summer. All about that pink life. <laughs> you guys are probably so sick of me talking and showing everything pink all the time. Hey look, something different, it's yellow. So this is just a camisole, just a little lacy cami. And this is a medium. This is brand new, still has the tag on it too, I think. But um, yeah, just a simple little camisole then I got this is so cute I saw this in the little girl section as well it says beautiful southern mess on it just like so and I think that this would be very cute to wear during the time of the county fair in my area with my boots and my wranglers and just all cutesy and whatnot nice and flowy for summer okay and then there's only two more items left this was the first item I grabbed. It's Abercrombie & Fitch, but I thought it was kind of unique and different for being Abercrombie & Fitch. That's why I grabbed it. It's like a lilac, kind of stripey, I don't know. It's very thin and sheer, but it's so cute. I don't know. I'm not sure if this is gonna fit me exactly, but it'll be fun to kind of throw on over other clothes. It's just kind of like a fun little pop of pastel. I mean, even if I wear it um, not buttoned. Oh, it will fit buttoned though. That's good. But yeah, even if I wear it just kind of loose and not buttoned, it's still kind of cute. Kind of give another dimension to an outfit. And then the last thing I got, I was gonna say I saw, but I got is this, I'm gonna call it a hoodie, but it doesn't even have a hood. It's this long sleeve and it is like a blushy light pastel pink and it's got some kind of cream 
detail on the bottom right there and then on the sleeves as well and it's got some drawstrings right here at the top and then a little zipper just at the top there it doesn't go all the way down um i don't know i thought this was just kind of cute different fun and this will be adorable during the fall and winter months especially of course i'm not going to be wearing it right now outside because it's literally been 100 degrees here lately but it'll be cute to wear later on i'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this video i really hope that i will see you guys at my meet and greet or my meetup uh july 9th again it's like a month or so away but just wanted to let you guys know ahead of time and i will mention it here and there throughout my channel until then uh but yes i'm very excited about it and i can't wait to meet all of you guys and again a huge 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 shout out to seattle children's bargain boutique for wanting to team up with me and give back and i love this so much and i love you guys so much and with that being said i will talk to you all next time so until then so long stay strong stay true and be you all right bye